hello beautiful family hello welcome back to our channel how are you guys doing i hope you're good i hope you're keeping safe to my return subscribers thank you for always coming back to watch my video and to those of you that are coming across my video for the first time i said relax i enjoyed this video i want to talk about 3 a.m bath with sea salt 3 a.m bath with sea salt and divine grace yes guys now i just want you to know that some things when you are trying to get some solution and it's not working you try another way you try another way to do it maybe the, the they are used to you betting it in the morning you betting it in the afternoon you betting it in the evening they are used to it try it in this way by the time you try it in this way you will see different results now i want to let you know that some things that will give you results is when you do an unusual thing by the time you do an unusual thing you will experience an unusual miracle yes by the time you keep on doing one thing one thing one thing it that thing may work it will get a point it will not work again it will get a point it will no longer work again so that is why we are going to take this bath 3 a.m okay irrespective on the day you are going to see this video we are taking this bath 3 a.m so set your alarm yes you can take this bath from now before you end october it's going to work perfectly you don't need much you don't need much to do just a little all you just need to set your alarm okay get your sea salt now this sea salt you don't need to count it as your hand can carry as your skin can take okay if you feel like you want to boy boy like this when you wear uh -huh. just get your water in your bucket get your water in your bucket okay when you get your water in your bucket take this sea salt put it inside that water take this divine grace drop it like three drop inside that water mm -hmm. like sea salt you can take three if you want to count but some people have uncountable one just put the one so you will drop it what are you going to pray you're going to pray that every chain holding you every chain holding your life every chain holding your progress every chain holding your settlement every chain holding your testimony to break to be cut off to break by the power in the name of jesus every evil chain every marriage chain every witchcraft chain every family chain as a family cause in your life holding you hostage anything using you to shine be destroyed you're going to pray that god will pass through this water that the the presence of god will pass through this water and restore back to you because we are saved by the grace this stand for grace so pass through this water and restore back to you your glory and restore back to you your new beginning you want to experience a new beginning yes okay then somebody will ask me what kind of um, bible verse can you read inside this water you will read psalm 46 psalm 72 and the next one you're going to read you read isaiah 43 verse 19 that after taking this bath, let them be a new thing, a new beginning of glory. A new beginning. That your destiny will start shining. That as you go out to work, you will receive favor. Now, if you cannot take this bath 3 a.m. in the night, midnight, you can also take this bath 3 a.m. afternoon. It must not pass 3 a.m. But preferable, the best time. It's 3 a.m. in the night. 
So how do you, when you mix these two inside that water, go to bed, set your alarm. Okay. Once it's 2.30, wake up. Read Psalm 51, pray for mercy, then start reading the Psalm. Psalm 46 and Psalm 72. This road opening Psalm. You pray after you don't pray in, inside that water. Make sure then you use uh, your middle finger to start turning that water. Turn everything around because by that time, this sort has dissolved. Prepare it like around 9, around 10. You go to bed. 12.30, you wake up. If you are the type that sleep too much, tell the Holy Ghost to wake you. He will wake you up. You understand. Then after, just pour the water upon your body. Bait from head to toe. If you are using wig. If you are not using wig, just wash your face. I say, man, bait from head to toe. Then after baiting, thank God for prayer's answer. That bucket you used to bait, turn it upside down. Yes, and go to bed. When you wake up in the morning, open the bucket back, pour water, rinse it, and keep it for another walk. And some people ask me, what am I in the morning that I'm going to walk? Uncle, another thing, sorry, another thing you add inside this water is your, your urine. Your urine, please. Before you start dating. Add your urine to it. Yes, so it's your urine, sea salt, water. Mm -hmm. If you have rainwater at home, you can drop a little too. Because rainwater is very powerful. Now, when you wake up in the morning, you want to bathe and go to bed.